I guess do our three ain't bad. Well, uh, anyways, uh, let's get started. Uh, tag team chamber match. New Day wins. No surprise there. It's 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 kind of fucked up. But the highlight of this match was basically Titus O'Neil is a beast. As soon as he got in there, he started slinging everybody around. And they put him with a tag team that never wins. They never win any big matches. It's just, it's ridiculous. And of course, Nikki Bella retains. Wow, didn't see that one coming. Quite frankly, I thought Paige was going to win. I never expected Naomi to win, but come on. Fucking let her win. She's the most talented diva on the roster. It's just stupid. You know, it's really ridiculous. I hope she wins in the future, but for now it's just, it's ridiculous. And here is my match of the night. John Cena versus Kevin Owens. Champion versus champion. Kevin Owens pulling out all of the stops, just dominating Cena with aggressive offense. You know, fisherman buster from the top rope. Uh, two pop-up power bombs, and they even used John Cena's finisher. It's ridiculous. Uh, you know, Kevin Owens actually won, and that's great. You know, it's he won cleanly too. That's that's the great, that's the best part of it. He won cleanly. I'm, I I like it when this, when they, you know, do away with the whole backstage politics stuff. And just let two guys have a clean match. And the right guy goes over. I like that. Uh, and of course, uh, Neville beat Bo Dallas. No surprise there. Uh, whatever, you know. And finally, well, in the IC title chamber match, finally, Ryback wins one. You, you know... He started out as Ryan Reeves in Tough Enough, then Skip Sheffield in in uh, NXT and the Nexus. Then he comes back as Ryback, gets has this big undefeated run, then gets screwed over by Punk multiple times, gets screwed over by The Shield multiple times, gets screwed over by John Cena multiple times, gets screwed over by Mike. Mark Henry at WrestleMania. Uh, you know, and there comes a time when you don't, you don't expect him to, you don't expect someone to succeed, but he finally did it. He has finally made it. His first championship victory. Now let's hope they actually let him run with it instead of, you know, giving it to someone else like a month or two later. Let's hope they actually let him run. And finally, the main event. A uh, pretty good match. Uh, no, no real complaints except for the controversy at the end. Ambrose won the match. He won. He won that match. And they just gave the title back to Rollins because of a technicality. This never happened in the Attitude or Ruthless Aggression era for that matter. Hell, this hasn't even happened currently until this match. This never happens. Why does it have to happen to Ambrose? Why is it that a referee that gets knocked out has to get back up and DQ someone just because just because they that person was being a dick? You don't do that. But Ambrose ran away with the title as he should have because he rightfully won. And that's that. So, I am Mike Wayne, a.k.a. Rebel in 80. If you are watching, please, please rate and comment. I need the support. And so long for now.